Yannick, we're here in Evian. First of all, how are you settling into the group? I think it's going fine. Uh, getting to know everyone, um, also by their nicknames, which is uh, a bit confusing for me. Um, but I, th I think it's going quite well, and I'm really getting to know the players uh, better day by day, and uh, of course also on the field, which is which is very important as well. So I think it's been a good couple of days. How big a part do the club play in helping you to settle down and in terms of meeting new people, those relationships are important, of course. I mean, the, the people that I, that I meet here and um, with the team, um, players, staff, uh, coaches, have all been very, very friendly, um, helpful trying to make it as easy as possible for me, uh, the transition, but also for, for my wife and I, trying to find somewhere to live, um, really trying to take it off our shoulders f for us, or for me to, to being able to, to focus on, on the job here and, and uh, taking that away from me, that, that little bit of stress that, that could be there. So a lot of help from, from everywhere and it's been quite nice. And there's some other new faces in the group as well, so you're not on your own in terms of being new. Does that help you as well? Of course, I think it's very natural that the new guys they they um, they look for for each other. They 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 find some someone who uh, experienced the same thing uh, for the first time as well. So I think that's pretty natural. Of course, I know Pierre very well. Um, he's helping me a lot as well. Um, so. Uh, I think I think it's been it's been pretty easy um, for the first for the first couple of days and uh, yeah I'm not really not really experiencing any any problems so far. I guess it's been quite a hectic summer for you. Obviously you were away with Denmark at the World Cup. Can you tell us a bit more about that experience? It must have been incredible as a young centre back. Yeah, I guess the World Cup had uh, was was a very positive and, and on the other hand very negative experience for me. It was not the World Cup that I had uh, had in mind. Um, I was I was looking to play and I was looking to to help the team on the pitch, but not everyone can uh, get, get everything they they want and wish for. So um, you just have to play the part that you um, that you uh, you're getting. And um, here was to be be part of a squad trying to get the team at the best uh, in the best situation as possible during training uh, if we're supporting during the games um, no one no no professional footballer is, uh, has this as his as his ambition but someone uh, has to do it so um, you need to be professional about it as well um, but the World Cup itself was a, was an amazing experience um, so much uh, Attention! So many, so much media, so many people traveling from all over the world to follow their countries and teams, and it was just, um, it was really, really an, an incredible uh, experience. And now the focus is back on club football. We can see that you've been worked really hard in the heat. How intense a period is this as a player? Ah, oh, this is uh, this is the phase that I think every every footballer um, enjoys the least. It's very tough. It's very demanding, um, but we all know, of course, what it uh, that it will help us during the season. That it um, that it is for us and not for for just uh, giving us a hard time. It is. We're putting a lot of uh, a lot of these uh, training sessions in the bank, and we will improve fitness, football. Um, so, as tough it is as it is, we know that that it will help us. Uh, during the season. All the work is gearing towards that first game against Burnley and making a positive start to the season. How much are you relishing that personally, getting started in the top flight? Of course the first game is very important. We, you would like to get off to a good start, uh, especially at home, but it is a, is, it is a long season, so this, uh, this training camp should also uh, focus on us getting uh, in, into a good shape so we can, uh, so we can be Performing at a high level for the entire for the entire season, not just for the first game, but of course um, 
it does mean a lot to start off good, uh, get a good first experience, a good first game, three points. Uh, of course, for the fans as well, uh, it's been a long time without an, uh, a home game in the in the stadium, so they're looking forward to it as well. And um, hopefully, we can we can go uh, into the season with a win from the first game. As a defender, keeping clean sheets is naturally the priority for you guys, but we've seen you score a few goals in training while we've been here. Is that something you've always looked to try and add to a team? Of course, clean sheets are the, are the most important, but the most uh, are very important, but the most important is to win. And if you win 3 1, I think uh, I would have that uh, instead of a, a, a 0 0 draw. Um, but um, yeah, I mean, we all started. Uh, playing football because we loved the game, and uh, uh, I was a I was a striker, I was a midfielder, and I was always pushed back a little bit when uh, when I wasn't good enough uh, in the youth. But I found it, um, I loved it when I was uh, pushed back in the in the central defense. Um, you can see the whole pitch; you have everything in front of you, and uh, you have a lot of uh, responsibility. Uh, the, the, the whole team is dependent on you and um, that uh, makes it you can it makes it not not risky but um, it's very important everything that you do that you do it uh, that you do it well because otherwise the team will suffer from it and uh, that is a is a challenge but a challenge that I, I enjoy so I'm I'm happy that I wasn't good enough for for the attacking positions, although I, I do enjoy scoring goals.